All right. Uh, my name is Patrick Sweeney, and I'm here to attempt the first sky drunk, <laughs> sky drinking <laughs> event of its kind. Um, I'm at the top of Hope Pass, which is an iconic point of the Leadville 100 course. Um, I'm going to be drinking four stone IPAs, running a beer mile back and forth, um, summiting uh, Hope Pass four times, going in each direction, running an eighth of a mile down and an eighth of a mile back up. I uh, don't plan on it being easy. Uh, my heart rate is really high just standing here. Bending down to tighten my sandals is difficult. Uh, I think 15 minutes would be a really good time. I'm usually about a seven minute beer miler or faster at sea level. So 20 minutes might be good. I think 12 would be really good, but I'm gonna give it my best shot and see what happens. So we're gonna do this in just a sec. Awesome. Okay, we're about to begin the beer mile. I've got my Sunto watch. I've got my beer mile setting ready to go. And um, yeah, let's do this. So, my GPS. This is a bad idea. This, this IPA is pretty warm. I'm stoked on cans though. Um, the cans are new by stone. So I guess, uh, I wish there was someone else stupid enough to do that instead of me. <laughs> it's just you this year. Okay. Yep. So next year I envision 50, 100 people joining me. But this year it's just me. So let's go. Okay. Five, four, three, two, one. Have you heard about the big strong man? He lived in a caravan. Have you heard about the Jeffy Johnson fight? Oh Lord, what a hell of a fight! But you can take all the heavyweights you got. We got a lad who will bait the whole lot. He used to work here as a doorman. Now he's gonna fight George Foreman. That's my brother. He got a row of party medals on his chest He killed 50 barmen in the west He knows no rest He got a man Don't push Plenty of room for you and me He got an arm Like a leg And the punch that would sink a battleship It takes all the army and the navy To take the fall off George Best And he thought he'd take a trip to Italy And he thought that he'd go by sea He jumped off the harbour in New York and he swam like a man from Cork He saw the Lusitania in the stress He shoved the Lusitania up his dress And he drank all the water in the sea And he walked all the way to Italy That was my brother, Silvest he, he got a row of party medals on his chest. chest He killed 50 barmen in the west He knows no rest Bigger the man, Hellfire. don't push Plenty of room for you and me He got an arm, like a leg And a punch that would sink a battleship it takes all the army and the navy to take the bra off Bay West. Have you heard about the big strong man? He lived in a caravan. Have you heard about the Jeffrey Johnson fight? Oh Lord, what a hell of a fight. But you can take all the heavyweights you got. We got a lad who will bait the whole lot. He used to work here as a doorman. Now he's gonna fight George Foreman. That's my brother. Silvest. He got a row of party medals on his chest. chest. He killed 50 barmen in the West. He knows no rest. He got a man. Elsewhere. Don't push. Plenty of room for you and me. He got an arm like a leg. And the punch that would sink a battleship. It takes all the army and the navy. Play the ball off. George Best. And he thought he'd take a trip to Italy. And he thought that he'd go by sea. He jumped off the harbor in New York. And he swam like a man from Cork. He saw. 2606. You guys <laughs> crazy. That sucked. <laughs> I honestly think. my stone IPAs and I want to continue to love my stone IPAs and I love the cans but I think I need something less carbonated. So that's worth a try. And I'd love to see someone come up here with some stone IPA and try to keep that time. And we'll see what happens. And, and live to tell about it. Yep. I'm glad I didn't fall. I'm not bloody. I'm in one piece. Had about five 
burps or stuff came out. Never over an ounce, I would say, but that could be questionable. But that's what I think. <laughs> Pretty buzzed. I kind of want to take a nap. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you guys for filming. You got Appreciate it. it. Thank you, Dave. You got it. Thanks, buddy.